Hello everybody and welcome back to Rimworld where we have just got a new colonist called Rick. Yay! Who can't fight fires. Better not be a pyromaniac. I didn't check that. Are you a pyromaniac? Just volatile. Gay nudist. Okay, that's fine. You can be gay, you can be a nudist. Just don't set anything on fire. That's all I ask. Now, I need to do a few things. Uh, we are starting to get a little bit more warm inside. Uh, it's not really being helped by the fact that we don't have walls completely at the moment. Um, we don't have... Oh, we run out of wood. It's very irritating. Someone chop that down. You can chop down a tree. Bark cutter. It used to be for hoodie, unfortunately. We need that tree chopped down right now because we need the wood for this wall. Otherwise, everyone's going to be absolutely freezing cold. And I don't want a freezing cold base. It's like minus three indoors right now. Yeah, that's warming up now. Do be really, really careful of things like that. Okay, so now what I would like to do is just make it go slowly. I'm going to unforbid these guys, and I'm going to tell someone, maybe like Hot Rob, strip them and then I'm gonna forbid the corpses once they're stripped down so what I don't want is anybody eating human corpses because it's gonna be really oh, it's gonna be really horrible otherwise right, so why is he taking that corpse dumping stock zone that's fine so if anybody would like these clothes I'm just gonna forbid that one for now then feel free to take any clothes you want. A nice thin thread shirt there, a nice parka there. Someone can wear that parka. Ben, like, you don't have a parka. Perfidy, you're like walking around in horrible clothes. So, you know, get the clothes if you want them. James, why are you. Watching the sunrise next to a dead corpse. Yay! Actually, for once, he's not. He's only just about to break. He ate a fine meal, so he's really happy about that. Slept in the cold. Shared bedroom. Blah, blah, blah. In pain. All the time. Not so good. Need to dig more graves, unfortunately. Um... Where do they keep them? They keep them under misc, don't they? Graves. Well, apparently the train can't support it. It will have graves there. I love how we've already eaten all the meals. Pretty much the constant state of hunger here. How are the crops doing? 33%. Woo! Okay, the raspberries are not growing at all anymore. I think I'm going to have to hunt. Well, Rick, you're quite good with a gun. Eating Mina a fine meal hall, that might cheer her up a bit. Rick, are you a good warden? You are, apparently. Ooh. Very good. Okay, cool. is urgently hungry. Could really do with a bed, all that sort of thing. See, I don't understand, like, with uh, Jeremy. 
If he's ever gonna get up. Shattered pelvis. We were just feeding him. Outside area. No, it's an indoor area. What's going on there? I don't know. I need to work out, like, when he's. Ah! Oh! These mental breaks are driving me nuts. I'm really trying so hard to keep their their mood good, but it's not helping. That there's corpses everywhere, and that they don't have. I think having their own bedrooms is really going to help. But unfortunately, we're going to have to knock you out. Sorry, dude. So Rick and Hot Rob. No melee, please. Not shooting. We want bruises only. But eventually, one of them's not going to survive, so it kind of... My heart's in my mouth every time that happens. Okay, so one thing we kind of need to do here is to start mining um, a little bit up here. Just enough to make room for a um, tailoring bench. Stressed out, stressed out, about to break. Maybe we can tell Rick to do a bit of mining. Rick's already changed all his clothes. He looks pretty awesome. So we've got one, two, three. Three people with Barkers on, which is pretty good. There's a cloth shirt there. Another synth thread shirt out there. And gazelle leather pants. Who could resist leather pants? Seriously. Now, have we dug any graves yet? Uh, no. Vinny is in a terrible mood. I don't know what to do for her though. She just has a lot of bad mood that's on her at the moment. Um, acute pain, disturbed sleep. Right, the corpse stuff will wear out in a few hours. I don't like that whole slept outside thing. I think their wall needs finishing. There's a wall. Doesn't need um, flooring though. We're going to need quite a lot of trees for that, so let's get some tree cutting orders in there. That's true, the huskies actually don't mind eating human corpses. I will literally feed them to the dogs. I don't care. If the, if the dogs want to eat them, they shouldn't have raided my base. You notice how my attitude towards these things is uh, slowly changing the more I play this game. But yeah, I'm going to leave them there. And they just No one really goes out there very much. So the dogs can just have some dog food. Mmm, puppy food. Nom 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 nom, says Pavlov. I like the irony of a dog called Pavlov. Okay, the floor in there is getting done. 
So the next thing I think I'm going to make them is like a billiards table or a chess set or something like that. Something nice for them to play with. Um, and then we're going to need to work on the food situation as well. Again. See, Perfidia's really unhappy, but a lot of the others are not too bad. James is pretty on edge. A lot of them are quite hungry. I don't want them to be hungry when, um, when there's human corpses lying around. That's just a recipe for disaster. I'm going to draft Ben. Perfidia's injured and about to break, so that's not good. Divine's just... Club. Oh, Rob's still a bit. Yeah, no. I'll go. Would be fine. Rick would be fine. Rick should get a new name as well, actually. Rick can be. Eha. Eha is back. Yeah. My typing is back. No. So Ben, Ehow, Lucky. No. I'm really stressed out. Well, Ben and Ehow have and Lucky all have Parkers, so they'll be like all right outside. So I think that we'll go elk hunting. Be there actually is quite good. For the elk hunt, and everyone else will just get on with their stuff. And I will just uh, queue up probably a chess table, I think. Billiards takes a lot more, yes, yeah, cloth and all sorts. We'll put that in just around here. Put a couple of stools either side. Make out of wood as well. Oh no. Ah. Forget to turn them around. I think they need to be turned. Yeah, they do. No, yeah. Wooden stool, turn around. There we go. We've still got um, some trees queued up to be cut down, so when they get more wood, they will build a nice chest set. Right, in the meantime, these guys are just going to go get some elk. Okay, I'll speed it up a bit, make them walk faster. Oh! Rena's gone berserk because she doesn't like sharing her room with Clara. Well, this is why we keep Divine around. Divine is very good with that weapon. Um, unfortunately, most of the people that can put them back in the bed are out hunting. So Divine... I'm actually going to make you a warden for a bit. I want you to do. So then you can at least put them back to bed. Hopefully they should only have bruises because um, they've been fighting with fists, so that's fine. Same with Divine, she should only have bruises. Cool, right. Those three are in position now. Might as well shoot that. Uh, elk there. Oh, Lucky, do you not have a gun? Oh my goodness. Right, okay, I'll undraft you. You may as well go home if you've got no gun. Ben and Ehow, hunting bros.
fry it and get more than one if we can. I'm our killer. Really? A raid right now? Okay, they're gonna prepare for a while. Right, okay. So, what I'll do is I'll unforbid the else. Okay. Oh, ben doesn't halt. How annoying. E how? Uh, we'll undraft you. E how can take one back. Okay, I'll unrestrict Ben and Eow now. Uh, pull that one back. Who's. Oh, oh! Really at the same time as a raid? I could really do without that. Right. Oh, and we've got no traps in there either. Or one trap. Hell, may as well. If we can. Pavlov has been beaten to death. Fiddy, did you beat the puppy to death? You horrible person. So bad. Half my people don't even. Ha I've had so many mental breaks that they don't even have. Um... Yeah, they don't even have weapons on them anymore or anything. Where's this raid coming from then? Oh god, it's this side. Um... Maybe they decided to go away. No, they're coming from this side. Okay. Oh wow, that wolf's been busy. So they're coming across the side that I don't want them to come across. And that door's gone. I just noticed that. There was no point in even rearming that trap. Except that they might accidentally come down here. Okay, where's Perfidi? James is fighting Perfidi. Ben, you need to fight her as well. Melee style. Alga, melee. This needs to happen quickly. Okay, Alga, rescue her. If you can. You guys get undrafted for now. And uh, we'll see what happens with these raiders. How many are there? I love those guys, Mega Theriums. They're so cool. Oh, this is so bad. This whole base is just so bad. Struggle the whole way. Is that roofed yet? No. Well, I may as well tell them to put a door in. I don't know if they'll be able to build it or even have the, the resources, but we can try. Fiddy's getting some joy, so that's good. She's cold though. Any nice, like, warm clothes? Labrador fur t shirt. Might keep you a bit warmer. Algo's gonna need to butcher. Oh, I really, really need these guys to just stay away for two minutes. 
Oh, he's butchering the puppy. Oh well, that just keeps the does keep the food need down. I thought there was a caribou or something coming in. Oh yeah, there is. Cool. Don't feed it. Don't. F I was going to be in a well bad mood after that. Honestly, feeding her bits of... Oh, no, you... Oh. Honestly, this is just terrible. Lucky, just stop eating that. Oh, you're disgusting. They're all just like, yeah, let's just eat these corpses. We don't even bother butchering them or like anything. We're just going to... Well, took one down. Priscilla and Lolita. Is that all we've got? Squirrel over there, apparently. Alright then. Ah, that door helped. Of course. Okay, lucky, go stand in that door. I'll draft you. Stand there. Uh, divine, go and stand there, and then you can melee attack Lolita. Fine, if you go in there, she'll run away. I don't think she's supposed to, anyway. Yeah, cool. That just gets them out of the way. Fiddy's fine. We have meat of some description. Elk meat. And some more elk meat, so that's good. That's all been butchered. And there's the other elk that's being butchered. Inside is 17 degrees, that's much better. Okay, I am feeling a little bit better about things now. Let's just strip these corpses off. Uh, we'll undraft everyone. Some people that are feeling a little bit unhappy there. Rena got up and immediately started being a pain in the bum, so divine, go and sort her out before she starts beating on Clara. One crack around the head, please. Should knock her out again. What? I am not happy with this. Or you can just go and sort out Rena. Good, right, okay. Um now rescue divine and Ehow go and take Rena to bed again. That will do. Hopefully it's all just bruises. Poor divine. Poor poor divine. Just tons and tons of bruises, so she should be fine. Oh, good grief. I thought E. Howard died or something. He was on the floor with a big cross over him. It's like, no! Um, that just uh, just says to me that we need more beds, definitely. Eddie, how are you? You look quite injured. Lots of bruises. Generally, people who are hurt, it's bruises. It's good. It's fine. Ben's working on our electricity problem. Rena's back up. 
raw cannibalism. Did someone feed her a human corpse? Grief. So that needs to be rearmed. And a lot of them need to be rebuilt as well. Increase the wall out to here, but we will need um, probably another door down here somewhere. And someone's got infected! Yay! At least it'll keep her in bed for a while. Fiddy, rest until healed. Ben can look after you. I don't want anyone losing a leg. Why won't she oh, I make that a medical bed? Then prioritize treating the and then prioritize prioritize treating divine. no medicine right now. It's pretty bad. 15% grown, not enough to harvest at all. We have a whole new range of guns though. Some steel that we can use to rebuild the deadfall traps. Another pistol. Getting some good stuff, definitely. Um, both spoil in one day, so Alga, you are going to need very soon more food to stay asleep. A lot of their problems are because of the bedrooms. Starvation! Divine is starving! Yay, how good. Alga, just start on the meals, please. We need meals desperately. We need a bigger storeroom as well. Oh, it's pretty good that we've got some meals outside, so that's really nice. She can just go and eat. Mina um, has had some food. Clara's fairly full of food, actually. Pretty good. Rina, right, we're going to deconstruct that bed, and that's going to be your new bed. Look, someone made you a bed. How good is that? Some of my colonists don't even have a bed. Like Ehau, who's basically making his own room right now. I think I need more people, like, prioritising um, who anyone that's not injured, I think, and is not cooking. basically everyone. Everyone's stressed or injured. I've got so many colonists. So I want eight of them. And like, it's like, oh, who can mine? Like, no one. Still looks like she's got a nice parker on, actually. Someone who's not completely about to break needs to go in sort that out. Stripping down the uh, the old corpses. Then you're a doctor, you should be able to cope with that. Oh look, the snow! Oh, it's making everything all white. But yeah, she's got a parker on, so that's totally needed. It's a nice one as well. It's a good one. Cloth t-shirt, a nice alpaca hat or toque. See a lot of them are getting their hats on now. Um, also strip down one. 
I think that might be another Parker, actually. See, I should have just started with electricity and then just completely not even bothered. How's your infection going? Still minor, it's at 20%. Okay, that's good. Animals are about. Do we have any animals at all? Winter is setting in and we're starving. There's a wolf and a rabbit. Foxes, ibex, rams. Couple of uh, turkeys, boars, things like that over there. Quite a way away, unfortunately. Quite a way away from the base. Ah, there's something up here. Oh no, the raspberry bushes. Yeah, we are terribly off for the food now. Almost hoping for raiders so we can steal their meals. We're cleaning up the base though, so that's good. Right, work on the graves. She's got treated bruises, so it's fine. Maybe get a parker to wear on the way. Oh no, you've got the parker already. Parker. Orga really needs a parker. Orga's come to get the clothes. That's much better, it'll be much warmer in that. Ben got the little pink one. So it's just Perfidy and James that need um, some warmer clothes now. Everyone else has got nice big coats. Uh, James, you could just wear that one. I'll be much warmer. Good. We're burying the dead. That's good. So we need three more graves. One's already queued up. So miscellaneous grave. One, two. Is anyone going to work on this ceiling? Did I even tell them to build a ceiling? Let's see. Uh, the area thing, isn't it? Zones and areas, and it is the roof area. Yeah, I did tell them to make a roof there. It's not a priority, particularly, though. Cutting down a few of these trees would be good, though. because I need some wood to build the nice little chest set that they're going to have. Mina, are you feeling a bit better now? Still pretty bad. 1% mood. But you have a bed now, so that's like an, an, an advantage, surely. Maybe we can make it so the puppy can sleep in your room. Your room is 14 degrees, still a little bit cold. So I'll queue up another lamp, uh, another torch to go in there. Try and warm it up a bit for you. Now, how are the individual bedrooms going? Pretty rubbish. What's he how up to? I'm assuming a simple... I think I need to make somebody a, a bit of a... Priority minor, honestly. Let's do that. 
Oh, did the rice die? Oh, that's frustrating. So growing time is three days, so it should take 15 days to grow and it's got nine days of life. So it should be able to get to about 60% before we should need to harvest it. The rice should have gotten, definitely should have gotten, uh, yeah, should have gotten done before then. Ah. Uh, Oh well, we'll just have to see what we can do. Got more wood now, so hopefully the... There we go. Just pull these stones out of the way. Yeah, so hopefully the chest that will be done soon. Um, and then hopefully the roof will be done here soon as well. And again, we have no food. But we have some new animals on the map that we can slaughter mercilessly for our own gain. So Ehal and Perfidi, no, and Ben actually. Gonna draft you. Are we in winter yet? We're not even in winter yet, we're like the 12th of fall. Winter's gonna be horrendous. So we are going to have to like hunt down every source of food we can. There's no nice growing hay grass, no nice like... Yeah, you know, that rabbit is even going to die. <laughs> Everyone and everything on this map is going to be food. no like thousand potatoes in stock for us in this one. Luckily Eow and Ben seem to be a quite a good little team. I know I'm not supposed to send the doctor out on, on errands like this but oh well. Has to happen sometimes. Okay let's shoot this guy. I love how he's not even helping his mate. Okay, go shoot this guy. Shoot him a bit better than that, please. Hunting with pistols! Always great. Come on. He's down. Start on the next one. Come on, we need this meat. Oh, he's a feisty one. He's fighting back. Hey, e uh, undraft you. E how can haul. Ben can't. Send a couple of other people out to come and haul. Alright, um. Allow people outside as well. Goodness, Orko is burying that one and not just. So they are digging graves and things. Go on, hot rob. Oh, we didn't quite finish them off. Divine is my basher. Bash, 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 bash. Okay, and once that caribou is in, that'll be the end of the episode because we've gone nearly 40 minutes now, which is a bit longer than I wanted to uh, go, but... I don't know, we had to make sure that there was... Oh no, disease infection. Did she ever survive that? 
61% immunity, so she must have been treated for it. We can only do what we can do with that, unfortunately. No! <laughs> Don't eat it, haul it, and then get Orga to do a bit of his butchering magic. Because there's meals already there, hopefully people aren't too unhappy with uh, their food situation. The base is being cleaned at least, and that's really good. Right, uh, tell them to haul a few of these rocks outside. Haul all of those outside. Don't want them in the base, thank you. Or any of that slag or anything like that. Okay, that pistol is now allowed. They're taking the rocks out of the base. Make it look a little bit nicer. Um, down trees, maybe. Any of these that they can. Unfortunately, basically whenever a, a caribou makes it onto the map, it's like, yeah, caribou, you are food. Whenever anything makes it onto the map, it's like, you are food. Um, so yeah, doing alright overall now. We have like most of them in parkers, so they can go out and most of them have hats as well. So one, two, three, four, five hats, six hats. This is Algor and Perfidi that need to be dressed a little bit more warmly. There is a parker there for, for Fiddy if she wants it. So a couple more raids and we should all have nice warm clothing. <laughs> so yeah, probably not the best way to get clothes, but you know, at least they're serviceable. So hopefully um, in the next episode or two, I'll be able to use some of the synth thread and things that we've got to, or and some of the like animal skins that we've got, because we've got quite a few now from sort of all the um, timber wolf, caribou leather, all that sort of thing. So squirrel skin even. Beaver skin, loads of beaver skin. So all of that will be quite good for making nice warm clothes. Um, so we'll maybe make them some better clothes so they won't be too unhappy with their ragged apparel. Uh, Ehow is busy mining out the individual bedrooms, which are smaller than I've made in the past, but um, there's room for expansion on them. So we can still sort of change it up a little bit, put different walls in and just uh, make double up rooms and they'll be nice and big eventually but for now we'll just mine them out and maybe get some walls in and I should probably just mine the whole area but anyway so that's the plan for going forward um, we just need to keep on trying to kill any animals we see because uh, the raspberries are not even growing anymore at this point um, it's literally <laughs> we're like a couple of days into the non-growing point and we are already really really badly off for of food so it's kind of unfortunate but you know, we are at least getting some gun practice in. So anyway, that's the end of the episode for today. And if you liked it, then please leave me a like. And if you would like to follow the series more and want to know when the new videos are out, then please subscribe. Hope to see you next time. But in the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome.